What's going on everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to clone your General Motors car key transponder using your X-Horse Key Tool Max. We're going to start. We've got our working original car key. And I don't have the blade cut for this yet, but we have one of these key DIY remote heads. We put a universal chip in there. And then we're going to roll pin a blade in there so this customer has a valet key. We're going to start by going to Transponder Clone. It's going to ask us to put our working key in our antenna. We're going to hit Read Transponder. You normally have to have internet for this, so make sure you're connected to the Wi-Fi. There we go. It says Clonable, so we're going to go ahead and hit Clone. Start Clone. 46 Transponder Clone. <coughs> Now we're going to want to hit original key clone at the top. I always recommend this even if you're using an aftermarket or secondary key. And what it's asking us is to acquire the data. What we're going to do is take our key. It's going to be a little tricky with uh, holding the camera. So what I'm going to do is use my knee and I'm going to hold this antenna right near the ignition and I'm going to turn this ignition on. So there it acquired the data. Now it wants us to take, oops, wants us to take the original car key, put it back into the antenna. Please take out car key. Oh, it's calculating data, so don't get too carried away. But then it's gonna ask you to take it out once it's done and put in your super chip. Take out original key. Our super chip is in this little pocket there. I apologize you can't see it up front, but you'll see here I put in the antenna and it should write just fine. No key detected. Let's try to uh, turn that to the side a bit. All right, I'm going to grab a blank one real quick. Alrighty, I am back. I've grabbed a blank out of the shell one. Maybe that key is just not letting it read. We'll put it in that pocket there. See if we get a different result. There we go. Write data, cop copy successful. So there you have it. Again, we copied the clone the transponder for this 2014 Chevy Malibu. We'll need Wi-Fi a working key, our key to a max up to the ignition to acquire the data, and a blank X-Horse chip. I hope that helps. Thank you for your time.